we're going to have a look at the way in which an amputated limb grows over the course of about 90 days in a salamander. That's a time-lapse movie, watching that thing grow. And now we're going to see what's really going on. Here's the salamander, and it's got a completely new limb. It looks perfect. It has inside bone. Good morning. This is Typhoon Tim down at Gulf of Maine. I'm at my office uh, at our biological supply business here. And uh, today I just want to do a little lesson on uh, uh, sea stars and how they regenerate uh, missing uh, rays or limbs. So uh, I've been down to the, to the beach and I've got a whole pail here of uh, northern sea stars. And what I'd like people to be able to see is the, the different types of uh, uh, growth in these starfish as they're regenerating limbs. So we've got a bunch of uh, different stars and you can see we've got some that are missing and regrowing one or two limbs. We've got some that are, uh, uh, here's an interesting one. This one is actually, I don't know if it's a mutation or what the situation is. It's, uh, it's got one limb that's damaged, one that's uh, a ray that's looks like growing uh, two new little buds there. And then we have a bud coming out of the top of that particular arm. Uh, here's an interesting one that uh, looks like he, there's a lot of fishing out here that uh, sometimes I think may damage the stars and that's why we've found quite a few that are regenerating. Uh, here's an interesting, right, this, this star has four arms and I don't see any evidence of a fifth one budding but obviously the, the normal starfish will have five arms or rays. Here's an interesting uh, large northern sea star. And this guy, let me set him down, has one arm that is actually split into and regrowing like a fork. I don't know if you can see that there. So there's uh, obviously.